Fixing a terrible green screen in any video editing software seems pretty much impossible, but what if I told you it is in Premiere? The method I use is really simple and straightforward. If you take a look at the footage, you'll be able to see that I did my best to make this really challenging for me to key the background out. The effect we'll be using is called HSL Secondary in the Lumetri Color settings, and it allows us to change the settings of a single color. Simply select the green that is mostly visible and adjust the overall correction so that you know which color you have selected. And do not forget to drag this plus sign towards green. You'll also be able to monitor your progress thanks to this setting because after that you're going to click the color picker with the plus sign and you'll keep selecting different shades of green. Feel free to change the scale settings while picking each color. Afterwards, I recommend increasing the blur to something around 1.5. Next, we are going to turn down the tint all the way to minus 100, the contrast up to 100, and the saturation all the way up to 200. Under the correction tab, you'll be able to see a little dot, and next to it, there will be three dots placed next to each other. Click onto that. Here, I find that increasing the midtones, along with the shadows, and decreasing the highlights works best for me. Let me know in the comments what worked out best for you. I advise you to re-watch the clip again and look for weirdly pixelated areas. In that case, all you have to do is click the color picker with the plus sign and click onto the zone in which you have that kind of problem. If you want to achieve the perfect chroma key or if it still doesn't look good, you can do this multiple times until the green color is totally even. To do that, just look for the Lumetri color effect in the effects tab and repeat the process. Let's compare both the before and the after effect. 